अगर आपने हमारे एक रिसेंट वीडियोस को देखा है तो हम लोग क्या कॉन्सेंट्रेटिंग ऑन कॉम्प्लेक्स फैमिलीज और उनके जो बेसिक्स हैं उसको हम लोग को जो है ना आज अभी हम लोग क्या करेंगे वी विल ट्राई टू फाइंड आउट दी आर्ग्यूमेंट ऑफ अ कॉम्प्लेक्स सम सो हाउ डू वी राइट दिस आर्ग्यूमेंट ऑफ अ कॉम्प्लेक्स सम सो व्हाट इज आर्ग्यूमेंट ऑफ अ कॉम्प्लेक्स सम बट दैट मींस अगर इफ अ कॉम्प्लेक्स सम इज ए प्लस आई बी फॉर्म then the argument the argument of set is is tan inverse mod of b by a now this is a now uh, there are few things to be uh, noted ki if the argument has to be found out it depends upon the quadrants if you see if we have This as your imaginary axis of the complex number. This is the real axis of the complex complex number. If if you see, this is your first quadrant. This is this is your second quadrant. This is your third quadrant, and this is the fourth quadrant. The argument value, the value of the argument depends. If this is the first quadrant. Suppose this is your complex number. This is represented by this, right? If this point is say a comma b, right? Then this is the argument. So what is this? Argument is basically theta. If it is in the first quadrant, if it is in the second quadrant, see, if it is in the second quadrant, the argument will be, it will be, this is the argument. So it will be pi minus theta. So this will be pi minus theta. So if it is in the second quadrant and your points are, how to find out in the second quadrant? It is minus a comma b. Then the argument will be pi minus theta. Now what is this theta? Theta is the same value which you have found out by taking the tan inverse of the mod of b by a. Mod of b by a, right? Now how to find out the argument for quadrant four and quadrant three? Simple. Put the minus of this. Here it will be minus theta, right? And in this case, it will be minus of pi minus theta. That is minus pi plus theta. I hope you got this. We'll take some questions in the next video to make it more clear. Thank you very much for watching our videos. Shabakar.